According to Passmore, in the 1950s, the average North American reference man, weighing 65 kilograms, would have expended on average 3,200 kilocalories per day. The general assumption back then was that the reference man in the 1950s was a farmer. The typical 25-year-old farmer weighing 143 pounds would expend 400 kilocalories more per day compared to a sedentary clerk and 1,200 kilocalories less per day in comparison to the heavy laborer. The accepted convention was that most healthy workers should be able to expend on average 5 kilocalories per minute, 8 hours per day and for a total of 6 days a week and for 50 weeks per year. Consistent with that estimation, the heavy construction worker of the 1950s would have expended up to 2400 kilocalories per day at work for a total daily energy expenditure of 4400 kilocalories per day. As Americans moved into the latter half of the 20th century, the transformation of the economy from manufacturing to service oriented brought significant changes to the daily average energy expenditure of the typical reference worker. Indeed, sedentary work involving data management while sitting at computer terminals began to progressively occupy a greater proportion of the workday. This brought the 1200 kilocalorie expenditures of the typical reference man down to 800 kilocalories per day, representing a 400 kilocalorie per day drop in caloric expenditure. The problem does not stop there. Calories expended outside of work also declined significantly from 1500 kilocalories to approximately 1100 kilocalories as TV viewing and computer games began to monopolize the interest of the population, thereby causing total daily caloric expenditures to decline from 3200 to 2400 kilocalories per day, representing 800 fewer kilocalories burned per day. At the same time, the number of calories consumed per day has increased because of frequent ingestion of sodas, frequent snacking, and abundant junk and fast food consumption. Typically, in the 1950s, the activities away from work of the reference man could be broken down in the following manner. What is remarkable about this breakdown are the daily calories associated with walking, cleaning, and maintenance work in addition to the calories burned preparing food and eating totaling 1,179 kilocalories and occupying six hours of the day. The modern day reference worker is likely in the service industry, which generally means customer relations or online support specialist. The reference 25 year old 5 foot 10 inch male worker is now heavier at 185 pounds and his typical breakdown of daily energy expenditure could be described in the following manner. Based on this profile, the modern-day man expends 500 kilocalories less per day in activities away from work compared to the 1950s estimates. Indeed, whereas the typical 25-year-old American male of the 1950s expended 1,500 kilocalories per day in activities not related to work, today's 25-year-old male spends 1,000 kilocalories or roughly 500 kilocalories less than the 1950s. The most notable difference is the five hours of dedicated TV watching and computer games per day since the year 2000. Also notable was the fact that less time is spent cleaning house because most families have fewer children to care for compared to the baby boomers that emerged during the 1950s and 60s. Despite many public health efforts to increase physical activity in Americans, no more than 15% of Americans report regularly participating in sport or gym. With the advent of microwave and the abundance of pre-prepared frozen foods, there is significantly less time spent cooking. And finally, the busy schedules we follow also translates into eating more hurriedly. Hence the total time dedicated to walking, house cleaning and maintenance, in addition to cooking and eating, only occupies two hours and represents a total expenditure of 413 kilocalories or roughly 35% of the calories burned for these same activities in the 1950s.